plan. Why? Well, you'll be spending hundreds, if not thousands of pounds at the expo. It's important to know your destination before you start your journey. Booking a stand space and just turning up is not enough to generate a return on investment. To plan effectively, we suggest around six months for exhibitions that are taking place nationally or overseas and around three months to plan for any local ones or regional ones. The more time you have to plan, the better it is for you. Having time to plan and prepare well in advance of the expo means you are free in your creative approach. It also means you can learn from previous expos. And most importantly, you can spend real good quality time with the right team to get the right results. We can use the time to consider our cost, breaking them down, analyzing them, and making sure we've not missed anything. And of course, we're not overspending. Having time will allow us to sit down with our team at regular intervals, brainstorming ideas, sharing experiences, and of course, creating that winning mindset to ensure the expo is a success. Now imagine, not only do all the team members know their targets and objectives, their roles and responsibilities, their expectations and outcomes, but also they have the passion, the energy, the commitment and the dedication to ensure that the expo is a success and they have the right level of energy throughout the whole day of the expo. A winning team needs time to get ready. So please spend time planning for the event. You're going to be at the event all day anyway, so why not spend time before it to plan for it properly? In our next session, we'll still be focused on the first P, planning, and we'll spend time in understanding how to calculate that very important return on investment. Thank <laughs> you.